you're a developer and you do not know how to create a launch file, right? Let's solve this problem today. Okay, what is a launch file? It's an executable file in which we describe all our node that we want to run and all the configuration we can provide and with the single command we can launch every node and configuration. And now we will have to create a launch directory. Launch. Okay. And inside the launch, we will create a new file. Node underscore launch dot by. All right. So this is our launch file. In order to use the launch file, we will need to make some changes in C make list. Uh, we just have to add these lines inside our C make list. We have to declare the folder that we made. So we, we have mentioned it here. So just copy it. Come here and open the C make list. And here you can paste that line. All right, so that's it. This is what you have to make change inside the CMake list. And now come to the launch file and here's a piece of code, copy and paste here. Let me explain what is it's doing. Here we are just importing launch and here we are importing a package and its module actions. There is a function generate launch description and which returns the launch description. Inside that we are choosing launch ross actions dot node. So here node is action which needs several arguments uh, like package name, executable file and node name. And we will mention our arguments here and it will be launching all the information that we provided. Our package name is turtle sim port and uh, our executable is the docker and if we want to change the name we can also do that here uh, like launch node okay so this this will be the name of the node we have to build it because we have made some changes in the c make list ross to launch and uh, turtle sim port and our launch file which was the node underscore launch dot by open up another terminal and check ross to node list yeah launch node and we can also see the topic list here is our topic so ross to topic echo and there we go we are receiving the data so can we launch the multiple nodes using the file the answer is yes and how you can do that we will just copy this and paste it here the package will be the turtle same and the executable will be the listener and let's make some changes here launch node cpp publisher subscriber okay now it will run both publisher and subscriber if we open the RQT, there we go. Launch Nord CPP Publisher and the Launch Nord CPP Subscriber. Uh, there is a topic. We also have a Python Publisher. We will also launch it. Okay, so I launched it and refresh. 